We're looking at my near-complete Fisher-Price Little People Collector Collection, coming up after this. All right, I love Fisher Price Little People, and uh, the collector collection is incredible because they have so many pop culture representations. And uh, let's take a look at all of them. Can I remember what order in, they're in? I don't think I can remember what order I got them in, but let's see. The ones that I don't have, there was an exclusive football. I think it was a. <laughs> I think it was a Go Bulls, and there are just two released ones that are uh, for um, well, the Super Bowl, and uh, you have to choose only one, and that's bad enough that you can only choose one set. They won't let you buy both of them uh, from Maddie Collector, and then you have to choose, um, and then in Canada they're not available at all. You can't even buy them. They won't let you send them to Canada so it's hard. Um, the other, the last one that I'm missing and I don't think I'm missing any others besides this is a Day of the Dead for, and I don't know why that hasn't been available on Amazon. Sometimes they say they're exclusives and then I find them everywhere. It's uh, really hard to know like this one, this Ted Lasso one. I, uh, oh man, I forgot these are a bit dusty. I better grab some kind of dust cloth. I, I, I might as well do the dusting while I show them to you. So first all, off we have this Ted Lasso set, which is, well, I don't even know if that's how you say that, because I've never seen this show. What is it? It's uh, Amazon? An Amazon show? No, no, it's a Apple TV show. But I bet it's good. I bet it's funny. And uh, you can see that all of the artwork is cute. They always put all of the characters on the side. It's a good set. It's the biggest, longest set. Now, the way that I have my wall set up, I don't know how I jumped into this, is that well, for some reason, these shelves that I made, I made this frame and I put all of my favorite little people on it. So you can see, I don't know if it all fits, but uh, these four packs fit so perfectly across, but however, they started not making just four packs. So they have, I don't know, they have three packs and they have two packs of this and the Kiss WWE. This one's really hard to find. I guess it was only available for a short, short time. I'm gonna talk less now and more showing. You can see how cute the artwork is on this one. Love that one. And then I might as well show the Go Bulls one now that I have that out. It is a snow globe, so it's not the only snow globe. I'll show you the other snow globe too. So that's really cute. Now this one I was able to buy from Mattel Creations. And look how adorable that is. I hope I'm showing all of the cute pictures on that. So yes, yeah, snow globe, cute. And that reminds me of the elf one. This elf one was the first snow globe from the movie Elf. And I mean, this one, most of them are unsealable or you can break the seal, take them out and then play with them. These, these ones you can't. Well, I haven't tried to open this one. I do have a double of this one that I've taken out of the box. There's no way to get it open. But normally, you can just cut the seal here and slide the door open and pull them out. And I've done that for some of them, but not all of them. All right, showed you that. Showed you Elf. Cute artwork. Put that back. I guess I should maybe put them back while I go. And then here is a new one for this year or for Christmas last year and it is the oh, National Light Moon's Christmas Vacation and look at the characters look how cute great display but this one again doesn't fit with the most standard version but they made it cute you know there's little surprises on the box you never know where you're gonna find a cute little illustration but it's adorable and there's 
definitely each character has memorable moments from their movies and wherever they're from. Now this was a four pack for the Rolling Stones and they didn't make this one in the proper uh, form. It's not the same height and then it's got the big lips on it. So I, I do get kind of disappointed when I can't keep them all tidy on my shelf properly, but nonetheless, they are adorable. The illustrations are adorable. The figures themselves are adorable. So cute. Rolling Stones. Then we have Inspiring Women. That was the set. This set is available at Toys R Us in Canada, so you can buy that one there. Still available. And a little bit different format here, but it is in the four pack. And that's cool. It's a special one. It, it kind of stands out because it's not exactly pop culture, more education, history. So they should do more of those. Should I, um, before I start doing all the four packs, let me show you. Well, no, I guess I'll split it up. Let me show you this very special one. This is a brand new Masters of the Universe one. And uh, they released that later. Now, they didn't put it in the right size. They could have, because it's four figures, but they did recolors. They didn't make any new figures since they had made Man at Arms, He Man, Skeletor, and um, Beast Man the first time around. They decided to make Moss Man, like in the original toy, Moss Man was just a recolor of Beast Man, and Faker is just a recolor of He Man. And then we have He Man and Skeletor again in. Skeletors in different colors. He-Man is looking the same. Checking my glasses on so I can see better. You know what I'm talking about? Does He-Man look the same? He-Man kind of looks the same. Same face, everything. I like Skeletors. Colors are a little different. But again, the artwork is adorable and incredible. That's just the universe logo. There's He-Man and Skeletor on the side of that. And then check out this artwork. That's super cute. Really cute. And then, I don't know, they put all these fake stickers printed on the package here. Adventure, Fantasy, Ages 1. What is that homage to? What's up with that? That's probably something obvious that I don't know. It's kind of a, a foil package. You can see that's cool and uh, let's go to the olympic sports the team usa now these the first two ones were hard to get in canada and really cool that's like this is summer games cute cool look at them i, I love that there's a shirtless guy in the pool and look at that yeah yeah adorable team usa waving there it's all four of them on the side. Really cute. And then we have Team USA Winter Edition. You can see it says age one to 101. I don't know what happens after. You're older than that. So cute. Cute. Really cute. That's kind of like the inspiring women, the uh, way that they did that design. Their individual shots. I guess they don't exist in the same community. And then this one was the third one, new for 2020. Is that right? I think that's how it goes. And then this one was available in Canada for some reason, even though it is US Games. But that is cute. 2020 was a long time ago, though. Gee, time is flying fast, I guess. So, look, karate, surfing, sports climbing, sport climbing. What is that what that's called? Sport climbing. Anyway, they're all cute. And the artwork's cute. And look at that down here. Look for classic Olympic sports. What? Oh, is that what I have here? Oh, yeah, that is what I have here. It's a classic Olympic sport. Right, and then, and then this is the newest one to the edition. 
there's no dust on this. But this is the Seinfeld one. It's so good. There they are. Jerry Elaine, Cosmo, and George. And look at the artwork. Adorable. And they all have in their hands some classic. Does, oh my goodness. And George has the eclair from the garbage in his hand. So, so cute. So good. Look, there's quotes on the side here. She had man hands. Yada, yada, yada. No soup for you. Look, all the catchphrases from the show. It's cute. And then you can also see that the backdrop, that's in Jerry's apartment. Adorable. All right, let's, uh, I think this one is also one that sold out and was hard to find. Um, the Lord of the Rings one. Uh, disappointed they put it in this box again. However, there are some of that they are putting at this height. So, I mean, I fill in the rest of the spot here with some of my favorite little people pieces, but this is the same. It's the whole tribe done in the cutest vibe ever. And then you can see them all down at the side. And then there they are on their adventure. Cute, cute, cute says something there. A quote from Gandalf. Cute, cute, cute. Label, label. All right, um, I'll show you this Barbie one. This isn't a, this isn't a collector. This is a kids, but you can see that they do make these sets, and I do have a few sets like this from the baby line, but it's it's just as pop culture reference and cute to me. Then we've got more, there's so many more ones. There's Kiss. So this is one of the first sets. Kiss, the Beatles, and Masters of the Universe. Oh, and uh, also the WWE one. But here is Kiss, unbelievable. We've got the whole gang there, and there they are playing their instruments adorably. And there the figures are on the side. Logo there, are you ready to rock? And uh, there's fans in the audience watching them on stage. Very, very cute. Shane Simmons right there. And then, and then yeah, cuteness overload. We have the Beatles in their yellow submarine garb with the yellow submarine in the back. And uh, there they are, John Paul Ringo, George, cute, cute, very, very cute. And I find the style is kind of yellow submarine style too. Very, very, very cute. And then we have The Office. That's a cool one. I'm not sure if this one sold out. Maybe they make more of some of them than others. This is one that I would think would sell out more fast. Faster than the rest. But you can see it's all office themed. Their are offices in the back there. They're looking real, real funny and cute. Um, little quotes. Little quotes there on post-its there too. And there's the, the gang sitting around uh, the reception. <laughs> very, very, very cute. Um, cute. All right, and then I guess this would be a favorite for many and be very popular. The likenesses, I never mentioned that. And this is a good example of how good the likenesses and how the faces can be so simple that they really look like the characters. And I mean, look at the coat bubbles above their head. That's the living room. You can see the lanai out back there. Fisher Price. Oh, it's got this Floridian wallpaper, which is so good. They're there in the kitchen having cheesecake. And uh, there's the four ladies there being extra, extra cute. Dorothy and Blanche on the bottom. So nice. And then the Christmas, a Christmas story. Everybody's got some. They're, um, ma they're outfits that are standouts from the movie. What I want for Christmas is, I think we all know what that is. Um, there's Ralphie 
Mr. Parker and Mrs. Parker and Randy. And that scarf is really long. And it's 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 just it's too cute for words. Everyone's so cute, so cute. And then last but not least is this avatar set. And I don't know anything about the last airbender because I've never seen an avatar movie before, but all I know is they look really, really cute and super cool. Look at that one. Awesome. I have to get them all. Yeah, I guess it's going to tell me there's some kind of ancient scribe there. And then there's Ugg and Katara and Soka and Tof. Tell me if I got their names right. And then, oh wow, we've got some other stuff here. We got a little character, and then we've got a um, got some kind of produce stand. Is it a coconut stand? I don't know. What, I don't know what those. I don't know what that food is, but it's cool. And they have some quotes on the back too. Really adorable. There is the world of Avatar, and guess what? This is flocked. And I thought it was just really dusty, but. They have a flock to this beast on the front. That's really cool. I wonder if there was any other touches like that. I don't think so. There's this run DMC pack. Three pack. Run, jam, and DMC. Really cute. Bottom, front, top, side. There they are. Really, really cute. We have an Elvis pack. Check out Elvis. Super duper cute. We have a RuPaul set. Adorbs. Oh, I guess they're all RuPaul. So, no name necessary. No labeling necessary. Super adorable. And then, oh, this is a good one. This might be a favorite. Is E.T. Look at E.T. done in a little people style. So that's E.T. Fisher Price is in the moon. Isn't that cool? There's E.T. Labeling the characters. Curdy. So cute. I hope you enjoyed this collection. If you know that I'm missing anything, I've got to get my hands on the Day of the Dead. I know a, I know an online retailer that has that. I think I'll have to order it from there. And uh, I'm I'm just letting the the three football ones go, I guess, because. The football ones don't have the best display. They have um, they have a flap that covers up all of the figures. I mean, you can kind of see it through words or something. But um, I guess I'll thank I'll thank my blessings. Well, I'm getting over lighted here. Um, anyway, thanks so much for watching. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Do you have a favorite set? I wonder what my favorite set would be. Hmm. Could I choose one? No. No. I like them so much. Really wish that one was in a a better a better shaped box, though. You can see up here, these little individual figures are cute on their own. Do I have a favorite of those? Oh, I actually kind of do. I mean, we have this guy who's super duper cute. And yeah, still have to open these up. There's all kinds of other sets, like there's zoo sets, and there's farm sets, and there's 
animal packs and individual animal packs. And then you got this super camping Canadiana set, which is so cute. And there's, there's just a lot. There's even there's, there's Barbie two packs. Even a little girl in a wheelchair, adorable. So much adorableness.